Hey Mauricio. Hi, how, how are, are you? you? I mean, there's tons of speculation going around with you and your relationship with Kyle. Can you clear it up for us once and for all? Oh my God. Um, <laughs> you have, uh, well, as you know, I usually don't like to comment about these things, right? But uh, this morning I woke up to uh, a bunch of, you've got it this so, it's so on my head right now, and so in my brain, you know, uh, I don't even have a Google alert on my own on my own name, but this morning I woke up to a bunch of different stuff, a uh, bunch of text messages from all of the speculation and interpretations about something that I said on a podcast. Um, and I received a text message actually from Kyle, uh, you know, asking me what I said and what that looked like and, you know, et cetera, et cetera. And basically, um, I want to I want to clear things up, okay? Okay. Kyle and I are human beings, okay? Mm -hmm. We have emotions, we have feelings, we're going through a really hard time, okay? Um, we are currently separated. Okay. Uh, we are not talking about divorce. Um, and we're dealing, we're trying to deal with this stuff internally, with, with ourselves, uh, privately. It's very hard when everybody interprets everything you said. When I answered the question on that podcast about where we stand the question was did kyle and i plant the story in order to create uh ratings in order to create all kinds of different things and the answer was we did not plant the story as a matter of fact at the time that the story came out from people.com kyle and i were not separated okay. and that's what i was referring to we were not separated um and we were dealing with our own issues internally and it all came out and etc cetera, etc cetera. that story has made us a lot stronger we've now had to uh have conversations with our kids we've had conversations with our family that's actually brought us closer together and it's been really really nice uh, to have that situation um, but uh, we are having our issues um, and I hope that sets the record straight um, and I hope that you know that's it right yeah, like, of course. <laughs> yeah I mean has Dancing with the Stars helped you with all of this Dancing with the Stars has been amazing it's been super therapeutic um, it's made me feel like a kid um, mm -hmm. I feel like I'm 15 years old right now. I'm having the time of my life. Um, and it's been really good for me to be dancing and to be dealing with all of the stress and everything I'm going through um, with uh, dancing with the stars. I've actually, uh, it could not have come at a better time. Of course. I mean, I want to know, I mean, with the rumors with Morgan Wade, I know a lot of people are coming. I can you set the record straight on that? Give us a little insight for that, please. I'm glad you asked that question. Mm -hmm. uh, there is no doubt in my mind that Kyle has not slept or cheated uh, with Morgan Wade. They are really great friends. They are filming stuff friends. together. They're doing things together. Uh, they are not in a relationship. Okay, thanks for that. <laughs> I mean, what are the chances you and Kyle can figure everything out, stay together long term? Yeah, I mean, I hope that we do. I mean, like I said right now earlier, we are not dealing with, uh, we are uh, divorce is not part of our conversation right now. That is not what we're dealing with. We're dealing with a separation. Uh, we are, we've had 26 amazing years. We've had a really tough mm -hmm. year. Uh, I think that happens. We're not ready to throw in the towel yet. We're, you know, trying to deal with it, but you know, dealing with it with interpretations and in the public and all of that stuff makes it even harder. It's really difficult and particularly when everybody has an opinion. Um, and it's like, you have to watch what you say, you have to watch what you talk about and everything's interpreted with so many stupid different ways. Um, I really just ask the public to just understand that we really are humans. Mm -hmm that we really do have emotions, that we really do have feelings, um, and that, um, you know, and we love each other. We love each other more than anything in the world. We will always be friends. We will always love each other. And where we end up, we don't know at this moment. Mm -hmm. That's why we're separated, to of try course. to figure out where we're gonna end up. But uh, yeah. we'll get there eventually. People.com or people or whoever put out the original story, they know who told the story to them, okay? They're the ones that really know. I ask people, to tell me who told you the story. Because if it's somebody in our camp that works for us, they deserve to get fired. If it's a friend Ooh, of mine, okay. they are no longer my friend. Uh, that was something personal that was sold and that was given to us by somebody that was personal and somebody that was clearly inside our life that shared that. It was not planted by us. So people, rather than just continuing this story and this BS of allowing everybody to uh, think and interpret that we planted the story when you actually know, tell mm -hmm. us and I'm going to do something about it. And I ask people to do the right thing and actually tell me that.